guys and welcome back to another video with me today and we're back with the legend planner so today I'm going to sit down and just plan my week. I'm going to show you how I do it, um, nice and simple really but as you can see these are some of the things I use for when I sit down to do my planning so let's get into it. So first thing I like to do, um, obviously open up the book to the page I am on and I grab my pencil. So I always write everything out in pencil first because if you make any mistakes it doesn't matter, you can just get rid of it and rewrite it, it's the best way to do. So the first thing I'm doing here is writing in all my important things and then I just do my schedule for the week. So as you can see, already made a mistake so let's try that again and yeah so write it all out, everything I need to do, so I'm currently doing my personal to-do list there, um, I've got the habit tracker above that, and yeah, I mean, if you've not seen my planner video, I will have it linked below, and you can see just what's on these pages in more detail, so I'm writing my reward right there, I can't remember what I wrote, um, <laughs> I think it was actually just to have a great birthday, so it is my birthday week this week, yay! So that's what I wrote there, and here you go, here's a close-up really, so you can pause and see what I wrote. Now let's add in some colour, so these are one of my favourite sort of collection of pens to use when I do my planner. Good, good pens, it got thin and obviously just kind of like a felt tip as well. So writing in the date to start off with here. So these are something new I found. Um, they are highlighters, but they're erasable highlighters. So, I mean, I didn't even know that was a thing. So I was super excited when I found these. So um, <laughs> I am just highlighting my birthday as obviously very important. So I wanted to make sure that it had all the colour going and it was just, it just stood out really, I guess. <laughs> So I'm starting to add some colour now with the, obviously what I've written already, just going over it with those pens. And again, I'm adding all the multicolours for my birthday day. You've got to have fun when you do your planning. You've got to add all the colours, pictures, whatever you feel helps you be creative, helps you stick to a plan, helps you schedule things, whatever you like to do, just do it. This is the way I like to do it, so hopefully it'll just give you guys a bit of inspiration or anything like that. Just, 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 just be creative, really. So here I'm just adding in now all my important things to do and I'm kind of colour coding them. So I just added in my workout schedule, now adding in my sort of video schedule and whatever else I've got going on really this week. It's quite a busy week. So just adding everything in there. And as I say, trying to kind of colour code it. I don't have specific colours for each week what things will be. I just make sure that that week everything that's the same is in the same colour. And here we go, we just get rid of all the pencil. So now onto the stickers, I like the stickers. So here I'm going to put these crucial ones, so the very important things I need to get done. I'm just going to pop them in there and as you can see I do need to get some more stickers so I will be on Etsy and having a look. Uh, if you do have any favourite stickers that you guys use for your planner, do let me know, leave a comment, leave a link, because I'm always on the lookout for more useful stickers. Obviously you've got to add the celebrate sticker there, and we're going to pop that next to my birthday. Okay, so this is the houseworky stuff, got to pop that in. So onto the pink highlighter and I'm just going to highlight the boxes, so for my reward section, for my habit tracker and for my to-do list. Now I didn't add anything on my work to-do list because that's to do with work and I didn't want to put that on there so that's for my own benefit really. Okay. 
and again I'm just going to go over everything in pen just so I can see it and I'll get rid of all the uh, pencil afterwards and with the habit tracker I have circled each day with a different colour because as I fill it in I do like to colour it in and make it kind of look like a rainbow. So now these are brilliant stickers, these are sort of motivational little quotes really so I do tend to pick the best for I guess how my week's looking and I like to pop them on the little notey bit on the page um, to the right hand side. Let me know if you uh, found any that you found particularly useful to you, which one was your quote that you could see. So I've put one there and I like to again, I just draw around everything, just make it look fun, colourful, just eye catching I guess and it just helps me remind myself why I picked that really. And this week I decided I wanted two, so I'm going to add that one on. That one was very sort of, it shouted out to me because this is sort of the end of my first goal of my 30 videos before I'm 30 and I did it here we go so this is the finished piece like I say it's just nice and colourful so do let me know what you like to do with your journal and I hope you enjoyed planning along with me